Oh my gosh, I'm running out of Timmy's. Well, hello, glue troopers. It's Max's Max's Models, and I'm glad to be back home. Uh, the trip went really well. It literally was largely blue skies. Uh, a little cold up north, but not bad. And uh, got in early, got to fly straight into Jacksonville, so I didn't have to drive up for Orlando. And that was a really nice change of pace. Well, as you look at the Apache helicopter, and by the way, if you can hear that helicopter flying overhead right now, that's not a sound effect, that's a real helicopter. Um, how apropos. The Apache managed to get home without any uh, serious damage. There was, however, uh, actually there wasn't really any what I would call damage. There was, however, a slight bend in one of the landing gears that I was able to work out. One thing I noticed is the CA glue, uh, that Loctite that I used, left this white residue on the model. And, you know, I notice that happens a lot with CA glues. And I don't pretty sure I didn't put any glue on those areas that have turned white, so I'm inclined to think that it's probably something to do with the gassing out process. I know some of you guys really know the chemistry of this stuff. Maybe you got some comments to add. And uh, one nice thing is that since it's, I do have the correct uh, Army helicopter green to paint it in, uh, and there's the, the cockpit will have to be detailed a little bit in some of the ordnance, but you realize as you look at the side panels, it's, it's only a few highlight areas. It's primarily uh, monocolor uh, vehicle, so uh, that, that should make uh, detailing it, even though I've already put it together, fairly easy. The Hawker made it without any trouble, and these two kits are going to go on the under construction pile, since I've already started them, along with the other kits that I still haven't painted from the last road build. The uh, BF-109G is uh, probably just going to go in the stash for right now, but the Mustang is going to go on the uh, with the other two Mustangs that I have that I already talked about for the comparison build. And I think I'm gonna see, since it comes with these lightning bolt decals, I think I can modify those and make a uh, nice uh, Florida Air National Guard uh, lightning bolt pattern. And I've always wanted to do a Mustang and I wanna do an F-86 in the Florida Air National Guard or FANG uh, markings for my Florida Air National Guard collection. And also it would serve as my Korean War era P-51 because I want a uh, Korean War uh, P-51 for my Korean War era shelf. So uh, that might be a good candidate for that. And that's where we sit on those. I also want to uh, promote, uh, and I'll be doing this a lot in the near future, uh, the Deezerland uh, model car contest down in Orlando that I was invited to be a judge on. So. Uh, I'll be pushing that a lot to remind people about it. I have been getting a few pictures starting to roll in for the Karma build and a couple of regular viewers build images and uh, really nice stuff coming down the pike. Folks have asked me to uh, continually post the planned group build, so I'll, I'll try and uh, make a... Uh, when I'm on the road, that's not a lot I can do. I don't have all my resources, but when I make a video from here at home, I'll try to make sure to put that uh, proposed schedule on the uh, comment section each time so you guys will have a quick reference. This is all for good fun. We can always stretch the timelines or whatever. And if you're working on something and you don't get it done before the group build, don't worry about it. Like with the B-25, I can always make an addendum build afterwards. Uh, the thing is, I want you to have a good time. I want you to enjoy yourself. We have enough pressure in life as it is. I certainly don't want to add to that. Have fun with it. Please, whatever you do, just... If the model doesn't turn out great or the way you want it, photograph it from its best angle and don't sweat it. Have a good time. And as always, make it what you want it to be. If I didn't mention, also, I am planning a live stream Saturday night at 7 o'clock as usual. This is Max and Max's Models. Take care of yourselves. And as always, model on. It's Saturday Night Live Stream, featuring Max of Max's Models, with possible guests, Orange Tabby, Trey's Models, Scale Model Garage, 
as Steve's Model Mania and other surprise guests as they show, including promotions for Deezerland Model Contest. And now your host, Max of Max's Models. <laughs> 